So one of the things we also still needed to do, prepare this for a new window. Let's do that. Is that a camera? Do I need to bark again? Not yet? Where's your sister? Ah, there she is. Hey Zoe. Bom dia. Who ate this pack of cookies? Maybe Dixie and Gina. I do like to have a window on this side of the house. It's also very practical for letting it air out a little. Uh, it's also nice to see the square. Kind of cool, like the same height as the street. So one of the things we also still needed to do was prepare this for a new window. Uh, it's now 75 by almost 90. So I'm gonna have a look on the internet what is for sale. What are like standard measurements for a window. So we can make it exactly that size. Well, not exactly, <laughs> a couple of mil bigger. <laughs> Don't make that same mistake again. The girls are already enjoying lunch. You don't like your ear? So he's chewing away. How's lunch, Zoe? Oh, there we go. Yeah, no lunch for me yet. Uh, let's dive behind the computer for a minute. So I already did some uh, pre-investigation. Uh, I looked at Maxmat and at um, Leroy Marlin. Uh, so we don't want a big window like the others we have. So I want uh, something with 7590. So this is 7500, we could do that. Uh, but that's already like 209 euros. That's the cheapest ones on the side. And if I look at Maxmat, uh, they have a little bit different sizes, but they're cheaper. <laughs> so for instance, you have here the 75 by 75, uh, turning right or turning left. And that's only 119. So I would have liked to have shutters in all my windows. Um, but if I put shutters in this ones, uh, then I have to make it a lot lower, uh, even below the street level. Now with the gutter, that's not a problem, but I think it would look a little bit weird. Um, and I'm not prepared to um, make it uh, a lot larger because the ones with the shutters, they automatically get uh, 30 centimeters more, 25 centimeters more height. So we're gonna do it without shutters and then maybe um, Later on, we'll find some solution if we need shutters there. So, yeah, I think 75 by 75 is going to be great. Uh, right turning we're going to do. Yeah, so that's a PVC. The other ones, um, all the other stuff I have is aluminium. 
Um, but that's mostly uh, because it's in the sun. And the other window is on the other side of the house. So I don't think PVC is a problem there. I would rather have aluminium, but they're a lot more expensive and also uh, not in these sizes. So yeah, uh, we're gonna make it 75 by 75. We're going to take all the old stuff out, and then take this lintel out, and then we need to go a little lower, right? With the top. E. 75. Let's do that. So I got it almost to 75, but um, 75 wide. But uh, we need some uh, space to put the cement. So there's no other chance than I have to use the grinder. Uh, this middle part is sticking a little bit more out because they made it exaggerated like this. So the middle part here and the middle part here, I'm gonna grind off a little. About a centimeter. It's not much. Uh, and then I still want to see if I can get them at least the bottom like cemented in. So that, that can dry and tomorrow we can do then the sides. Cool cool. Uh, first some lunch. What are you looking for, sweetie?
that should be sufficient. Uh, everywhere I got the minimal 77 centimeters. So that's a centimeter on both sides. Cool, still not my favorite job, this grinding. <laughs> um, now I'm gonna put on the board, like you also saw me do with the other windows. And I have the hooks that I still borrowed from Alex, from uh, Quinta Fonte de Pipa. Uh, I need to buy some of these things myself. I'll return them uh, to you after this job, uh, Alex. Uh, but they're very handy, you can just um, uh, drive them into the wall and then uh, make sure that the board uh, is stuck against here. And then we level it out on both sides and then we pour it up with concrete. I think we'll get this in today. Although Akira is uh, waiting for the walk. That's nice, Riti. Waiting for the walk, huh? I'm gonna set the boards up, mix the cement, and then first uh, take care of my girls. And then uh, later I'll pour it in. Woo, big stretch. And big scratch. Where's the other rascal? Probably on the bed. Girls ready for a walk. Just in time.
Thank you for watching another video of the Portugal project. If you want to follow the Portugal project more closely, you can also add it on Facebook. Or add me on my personal account on Facebook or Instagram. See you next time at the Portugal project.